the bar. That's ah! always when to lift it. Get my <laughs> barely a cloud in the sky. Let's go get some turns in with Adia, my six-year-old daughter. I won't fall. <laughs> I can't fall. Famous last word. Do you know what it means to be too confident? I can't fall. We're spring skiing here in the heart of the Canadian Rockies. It's April. We're putting this camera to the test. This is the Insta360 X4, their newest 360 camera. If you're new here, I'm a dad who documents our family's outdoor adventures in the mountains. If you like the sounds of that, be sure to hit the subscribe button. More importantly, I hope you get outside for an adventure of your own soon. I think the best part about using a 360 camera is the simplicity of always capturing the action. The X4 comes packed with the following features. It shoots 8K 30 frames per second, 360 degree cinematic video. It also shoots 5.7K 60 frames per second and 4K 100 frames per second. In me mode, it can shoot up to 120 frames per second for that ultra buttery smooth slow motion footage. I'm the streamliner. You wanna straight line it? This is really fast though. You're gonna straight line this whole thing? Go from here and then slow down on the flats, go! The X4 makes it incredibly easy to capture professional, <laughs> cinematic looking footage. Flow state stabilization and 360 horizon lock are automatically enabled when you're shooting with the camera. It makes for super smooth, super level stable Woo! footage. There's new removable lens guards with a rugged design that are twist on instead of sticky on, which is an awesome improvement. The new battery lasts 67% longer and has a 2,290 mega amp battery. And when connected to the app, you have your own AI powered mobile editing suite that has some cool shot lab and unique effects. Over. Got you. Okay. Yep. Trust, stand up tall. And then another one. Oh. There you go. Nice job, Luca. <laughs> okay. One. There you go. Now you're over those trees. Feel good. Are you a little bit scared? No, not really. There's too much powder. You got a lot of powder. Yeah! Okay, now, hang on, Woo! Adia. Okay, I'm gonna briefly show you the intuitive touchscreen on the face of the X4. It's super easy to use. So in the top left corner, you've got your SD memory card, how much time you have left recording at that current mode. The bottom bar here, it tells you your resolution and your frame rate. Top right here, we've got the battery life. I'm in vivid color mode. So right now when I swipe from the left, I can actually choose a couple different standard kind of automatic color grading things. Mega wide, ultra wide, and de-warp, which you could be changing anyways in post afterwards when you're reframing, you can zoom in or out. Here you can see what I'm looking, what you're looking at here, the back camera lens. You can see some of the extra video modes here. We've got active HDR, time lapse, time shift, bullet time, loop recording, star lapse, burst mode, intervals, HDR photo. This is a fun, creative camera. Silly bean. You wanna have one silly bean? The frog. If you eat a frog silly bean, you might end up jumping higher off jumps. <laughs> Right now I've got the X4 mounted to the invisible selfie stick on this pole mount, which is super fun. It's really easy to just hold and ski. And uh, I get some really cool shots of it like this. If 
you're on the market for a new action camera, maybe you need to upgrade an old one, maybe you never got one before. Honestly, every year they get better and better. This is this is it. This is the, the newest, best 360 camera on the market. I will leave a link below in the description. If you have any questions about the camera before you buy it, please leave a comment. Let me know. I will do my best to answer the question. You've got the X4 with the mic and you're gonna go for a little run here. I said I almost dropped your pole. How dare you? Got it. If you don't want to deal with any of the editing of reframing, me mode on this camera is a great option to turn this camera effectively into a single lens camera that keeps the bottom of the selfie stick in the center of the frame. So as long as you're holding it in the middle or the core of your body and kind of keeping it in the center of your body, this camera is just gonna keep you in the center of whatever you're doing and boom, just creates perfect selfie content. Okay, I'm gonna connect the X4 to my phone using the Insta360 app. This is the one-stop shop. This is the place where all the magic can happen with the footage from the camera to the phone. There's a small, small learning curve. There's tons of tutorials out there and you don't have to be very skilled or you can go as deep as you want and try to learn a little bit more and play around with it to be more creative. Insta360 has a bunch of automatic AI and neat features that allow you to create some cool edits without needing any advanced editing skills. One of these is SkySwap. You can enter into the shot lab here in the Insta360 app, choose the sky swap option, and you simply choose the clip and the background. And in just a couple minutes, you're gonna end up having a cool edited clip where the sky has been changed and swapped out. I'm usually using the normal 110 centimeter selfie stick. This is the one that's just my daily driver. I put it on, but occasionally I like to mount this camera onto the three meter stick. If you're on a chairlift, you get some really amazing cinematic views because the stick is so long. You get, you just get a further POV, which is pretty cool. And then of course, if you're follow camming somebody high up in the air with a three meter selfie stick, you get some really cool footage. So I did that today with Adia, had a high, I was skiing backwards, had this thing really high in the air. I think it should provide a pretty cool like aerial kind of look as if there was a drone. I like to coin the three meter stick, the poor man's drone. The X4 is perfect for anybody who travels or goes outside for adventures. You don't have to be a content creator. You don't have to take a ton of content, but when you have a waterproof camera like this, that's durable, uh, has built-in stabilization, it just makes it really easy to capture the action. And with a 360 camera, it doesn't matter which way you're pointing it. You're always recording all directions. And then you get to reframe the video later to tell your phone or the app on the computer where to look. And then it spits out a video that's totally usable to send to your friends or family. A 360 camera is the best way to kind of still stay focused and be in the moment because you don't have to worry about framing up the shot perfectly. Follow the action the best you can, pointing this in the general right direction. And it's filming you and it's filming others and it's great. I will leave you with an 8K time-lapse of our mountain highway drive here in Fernie, BC. If you need to upgrade your action camera, I highly recommend the X4, or maybe this is your first time wanting to get an action camera. Affiliate link left below in the description. If you have any questions about the camera, before you buy it, please leave a comment. Let me know. I will do my best to answer the question. Thanks.